everybody else. Up things down, down things up. Even Mother Nature gets confused and displaced. In just a moment, you will go through the doorway, down the path, and into Casa Magnetica. But before you enter the house, do us a favor and look to your left. You will find an unusual thing. You see, since Don Salvador lived most of his life high on the mountain where there was no gravity for water flow, he invented a device that allowed water to go uphill. Don't believe us? Go see for yourself and welcome to Casa Magnetica. Please stay on the path and stay safe. Finally. It's kind of scary. It's like Runaway Mountain in here. It's Runaway Mountain. I mean, too. I don't remember this place at all. Oh. Oh, oh wow. This is really good. Oh, no. Oh, God. I've got the bottom of the back that you can hold on to. Try not to fall on the three people in front of you. There you go. Come on in. Hola. Come on in. Join us in the front room. Oh, hi. Just keep on moving in. Very good. Very good. Hola. Welcome to Don Salvador's first room in his house. I am Esperanza del Cordova. Now, I'm going to tell you all about this room. This is obviously the kitchen. And Don Salvador didn't really like to clean. Actually, he didn't like to clean up after himself. But he loved having a tidy house. So he would, you know, sweep the house and when he got tired or wanted to do something else. He would simply put the room down and it would stand all on its own. Are you impressed? Some of you are. I shall impress you with one more invention. Don Salvador found he had a lot of free time. So, he took up the art of painting. It's not very good. <laughs> That's because he was a terrible painter. So he would paint and paint and paint that would take him forever. That's why they were never finished. So, it took him so long that the fruits would often rot. So, he invented this table where he would just put the rotten fruit down and it would roll out the window down the mountain never to be seen again. <laughs> See, so, when he was very frustrated with his art, he would take all of these objects, including the box, and just roll them out the window down the mountain, never to be seen again. <laughs> <laughs> now, if you'll join us in the next room, you'll see many more of his marvelous inventions. Try to not, try not there. Well. Down on Tumble careful, tumble careful. Tumble careful. So, so. Be careful with the opening, right? Here, I'm trying to like keep it steady. Yeah. Okay, my name is Gloria, and you are now in Don Salvador's dining room. Don Salvador was a man of complete relaxation, so he created his chair. Now I need a volunteer from the office. You? You're the only one to raise the hand. Oh, Good luck, guys. Oh, I love this. Don Salvador loved fruit, but he hated kissing it. So 
Well, he created this system that made the food come straight to the table. You look lazy. You look lazy. And because he lived in the wilderness, food was hard to come by. Hard to come by. When the guests would stop, he would put them at the end of the table, roll them the orange. You see, they seldom got what they asked for, so they fled Casa Magnetica for the fear of starvation. Now, mis amigos, it is time for me to say adios. Hasta la vista, hasta luego. Gracias for coming for Casa Magnetica. You guys are the very first ones we opened yeah. up to this Woo! It makes a scary noise. I'll be the first to check out the magic well. Well, it's gonna make a scary noise, I just know it. It's magical. I'm like, it's totally magical. Well, that was fun. Bye-bye.